What's going on guys, Andrew Pillick here back again with another reaction video. Today we're checking out Rosé on The Project, I believe it was an interview. Um, the title is How Rosé's Blackpink Bandmates Reacted to Her Solo Music and Which Track They Liked the Most and it's uh, titled The Project. So this is going to be a cool little interview. Um, I think I'm a little late watching this one but definitely can't wait to check it out. So if you are a blink like myself make sure to subscribe to this channel i'd really appreciate it join the andy gang i'd love to have you guys here um i did start my very first show on here uh it's called the blink report it's going to be dropping every single friday so if you are a blink like myself make sure to tune in and check that out the first episode is up and a new episode will be up this friday but besides that i do have some links down below including my patreon as well as my discord um, i also have social media which is on the screen and linked down below for my twitter and instagram make sure to follow me there i do always respond even if it does take a little while i will respond to you uh, but the best way to support me on this channel is to like this video and subscribe but let's waste no more time here this is Rosé on the project. Uh, definitely a quick little interview here. And uh, let's go. Blackpink are the Fire. South Korean girl group who've transcended genres, borders, and have taken over airwaves around the world. Yes, they have. They've recorded hits with Lady Gaga and Dua Lipa, and yep. were also the first ever K-pop act to perform at Coachella. <laughs> singing all dancing quartet consists of Jisoo, Jenny, Lisa, and Rose. Yes, sir. Connection. Yep. Year, she's gone solo and has just entered the Aria charts with her own single called On the Ground, and it goes like this. Everything I need is on the Everything I need is on the ground. Oh my god. On the ground. Bro, this song's and fire. Rose joins us now. So thrilled to have you on the show, Rose. Tell me, how does a girl who went to school in Melbourne end up in Korea in one of the biggest bands in the world? I, <laughs> I'm not sure. I mean, uh, love Rose. Me, it was love just, her. Uh, I think I got very lucky. Uh, my dad uh, encouraged me to take an audition um, that was had uh, over there in Australia and I was just lucky enough to kind of make it uh, and debut as Blackpink. Oh, Rosé, congratulations. It's super exciting for us to sit here and watch you. What do you miss about life in Australia? Oh, I mean, there are so many things uh, that I do miss about Australia. I think this must be so cool for her. Things that I may have taken for granted. Uh, just uh, maybe just like the lifestyle. Um, right now I'm living in Seoul, so it's a very uh, busy city over here. But I think back then I lived in um, Bolin for quite a long time. And so, I mean, dude, she's I really so just happy miss, right like, now. I love that, man. That's quietness dope. Quietness and like just, I don't know, like the whole lifestyle was very uh, relaxed. And um, I had a really, really good time in Australia. So I miss just those moments. My childhood, basically. Yeah. It's True. an extraordinary story. You moved to Korea at the age of 16, uh, which I, I just can't imagine doing that. Was there ever a moment, it's turned out obviously very well for you, but was there ever a moment where you thought you might have done the wrong thing? Well, I mean, yes, it was very hard, um, I must say, but I think I always kind of... I would cry a lot um, because I was homesick. Um, my Facts. mom would be like, my parents would be like, you know, just come back home, just come back to Australia and just <laughs> let's go back to school and just do everything we're like, you know, already doing. Her um, dad used to call her too, right? I was so sure about it. I was like, no, I'm never going to go back. I know I'm crying right now, but I'm never going to go back. <laughs> and I was very sure about it. So I don't think I ever regretted it. Um, if anything, I was just worried that like, what if I came all the way to South Korea and what if I don't make it? Yeah, I was very sure about my future. Bro, Rosé is I'm, just so crazy dope. If I think about it right now. <laughs> Rosé, congratulations on the release of your new solo music. And just to be very clear on this, we need to be extremely clear. This doesn't mean you've left Blackpink, does it? Oh, of course not. Definitely Thank not. Thank God, uh, right? We're all just working on our solo projects in the midst of also working it with, like, with our Blackpink stuff. So definitely not. Rose, what was the reaction of, of your bandmates uh, from Blackpink when you played them, you, your two songs, you know, on the ground and, and gone? What was their reaction? 
they were actually like i remember jisoo uh she was like oh my god are you gonna go with that song that's like my favorite song i'm so excited for it to come out and she was like so sure about it um and it means a lot when one of your members are like very sure about something that's so, awesome like, oh, that's so song. awesome like queen it. jisoo so, like i'm really sure about it you should come out with this you know asap bro i love um, this interview what the hell uh, the other all, all the other members were actually like are you coming out with that song because so, so like it's funny how it's always like you know that there's that song it's like they don't even have to name it they're like oh is it that song we heard last time and be like huh. yeah it's the it's the song and so um i think everybody was very sure about it for me um they were very excited that's so, awesome yeah. We'll let you go, Rose, but I just I've got some it's contacts over. at the Bullying Basketball Stadium. Oh. If you want to play a concert there when you come back, I can I can make it happen. I'd love to. Oh, I also got to mention. So last time we were on um, tour as Blackpink, um, we we played uh, we had a show at the Rod Laver Arena, and I remember it being such a moment for me. They always say you got to play Rod Laver Arena before you play Bullying Basketball got Stadium. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I, did. So, <laughs> uh, I don't, don't know anyone who's played Bullion who hasn't played Rod Laver. Do you? Can you name, name one? one? I can't. I can't, I can't name can't. one. <laughs> Rose, new track on the ground is out now. Rose, thanks so much for joining us on the project. We'll see you soon. Thank you guys so much. That was a great interview. What a great video, and we've got plenty more. So why not click the subscribe button here? Sorry, bro. It? Here. Sorry, bro. Or is it? Sorry, I can't see the button. I'm not wearing my glasses. You know what, man? I might have you to. Can see, so, I might so have you... to subscribe for that guy. That guy's a legend, anyways. Uh, <laughs> that was a great interview. That was a great interview. You know, what? I'm clicking like on this video. Um, just an absolutely, just incredible, incredible interview right there. Short and sweet. I wish it was longer. I think they did a really good job. Um, but man, Rose is just. I, I'm I, like, I just as a blink, I'm really proud. Like, I think she's done really well excuse me um but just incredible very very happy i really 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 am looking forward to hopefully one day hearing on the ground and gone live uh that'd be really cool again it's like a dream of mine to see blackpink live in concert so obviously when all of this craziness is over what the world is going through right now um concerts is the last thing on everybody's mind but just I can't wait. So Rose did a great job uh, in this interview. She looked beautiful and uh, she always carries herself with class. So not surprised here that it was just a very, very good interview. So hopefully you guys enjoyed my reaction to this Rose interview. If you are new to this channel, make sure to subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Join the Andy gang and I do love and appreciate you all as always. Hopefully I'll see you in the next video or reaction. Peace.